Hey, what's going on guys? Rob from clicksgeek.com and today's video we are going through a live um, cash for cars, <clears throat> cash for junk cars client's account to show you how to optimize device bidding and the different device bidding strategies you can uh, you can use them as levers to increase your good traffic and decrease your bad traffic. So this is a really powerful optimization tool that um, a lot of people overlook to be honest. So you look at the last 30 days data, right? So that's March 28th, April 26th, 2022. <clears throat> this guy's doing really well. 134 leads, $22 a lead, 57% conversion rate, which is outrageous. So anyways, to get into device bidding strategies, I'm sorry, device bidding, we're going to go into the campaign, come down here to the left side to devices. You're going to see here we have three different options, desktop, computers, and laptops, tablets, mobile phones, right? So First things first, before you even touch device bid adjustments, I do have to tell you guys you need a solid data sample set. And what I mean by that is at least 50 clicks. So you have some data to work with. Obviously, the more clicks you have, the better. You can see this guy in the last 30 days has 204 clicks. So that's a good, that's a good sample of data. And before you make any kind of adjustment, you also want to make sure that you have room to even adjust. Because if you're getting 100% impression share on the page, then there's no reason to increase your bids because you're just going to pay more for the same traffic you're already getting, right? Now, how we do that is you come to columns, you add in impression share top column, and this is just a number that reflects the percentage of the time that your ad falls within the uh, one of the top four spots on Google, right? So you can see here's a percentage. So on mobile phones, 76% of the time our ads are in one of the top four spots. On tablets, it's 80% of the time. On desktop computers, it's 43% of the time. So this is telling us out of every 100 searches, 43 times our ads are showing in one of the four top spots. That's telling us a really important um, data set right here, that we have room to increase our bids because our target cost per lead is $33. We're at $19 right now. So we have a lot, we have a lot of runway here that we can increase our bids to get more of that higher converting traffic and the low cost leads. So the first thing I would do I would increase, right? You can increase or decrease. Increase by 5%. I do all of my bid adjustments in 5% increments in most cases. So that's how I would do that. Next up, we have mobile phones, and we're coming in at $22 a lead. We have 76% impression share, which means we have a bunch of space that we can run still. So I'm going to increase that. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to jump that up to 8%. And tablet, I don't have enough data, so I have one click or something I can do there. But you can kind of see how you can use these as different levers to, to adjust your um, your lead flow and your cost per lead. It's really powerful stuff. And now let's say tablet had 15 clicks and no leads, right? So that, that traffic source is garbage. I'm going to turn it off. And to do that, if you want to turn off a traffic source, you come here, decrease, and you would choose 100% and hit save. And that would turn off that traffic source. So again, really powerful, really um, simple. If you guys have any questions, drop them in the comment section below. Again, if you um, are a new uh, viewer, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like and share this video. If you want to learn more about Google Ads, there's plenty of links in the description where we have tons of free trainings and paid trainings and all kinds of cool stuff that you can check out. If you're a business owner who wants us to run your Google Ads, you can also apply to work with us in the description as well. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next video.